go ahead and get some information and shit that he's dropping. And the shit that he said in that video was so profound that basically I had to uh, piggyback off that like, uh, video and basically responded to what he was saying that the unconscious community does is actually a real thing, right? Check this shit out. So basically, right, the unconscious community really is the group of these people that's like agents, but they're not just agents, they're like um, reptilians and shit like that. They don't believe in that too far, but they sold and they spirited. It's like the Plymouth Demonic, and he also said that the light brothers and the dark brothers, and that's some deep shit that he said because if you've been watching my main channel, or if you've been watching it for a minute, then I do talk about and I still do talk about him. I just don't call him a specific name or whatever. But these entities are called the Dark Lords of the Universe. You can see, look. I don't know if y'all can see that. There's literally a drone. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Like, I'm trying to watch niggas, bro. Like, Billy Carson said, nigga, I'm a fucking 75 IQ, bitch. I'm a 190 IQ. of that, the Dark Lords of the Universe, they consist of these entities and shit, and they like groups, just like, kind of like religion and groups to a different sort of, how you want to say it, right, so for example, I'm going to give you an example of what I'm saying, like, you got, obviously you got Satanists, you see what I'm saying, but then you have people that's Luciferians, and atheists, and Scientology, and Ecology and all this shit like that. This shit looks real, bro. I don't know who the fuck that is. You see what I'm saying? Straight up Asian shit. I don't know who that is. But anyway, so look, check this shit out. They got Egyptology, Scientology, all that shit. You see what I'm saying? That is motherfucking dark shit, like, so to speak. So that will be categorized as the dark forces of the universe. Does that make sense? So you have so-called good religions or whatever, like uh, Christianity. And this is just an example. I'm not saying that these things are actually good, but just to give you a, a better example, I'm going to classify it for you. So like Christianity, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Catholic, if you already know what the fuck they do, but I'm just giving you an example. You have Judaism, Buddhism, Fucking uh, Satanism, you see what I'm saying? Um, shit, like, um, well, you know, just like some good shit, like, you just represent the light, not people who like demonic entities that's masquerading as the light, not that shit, but people who actually represent the light. You see what I'm saying? Categorize it. So, these dark entities, these dark brothers. It's a pyramid scheme. It all originates. Shit, this motherfucker just follow me and shit. What the fuck? You better not walk out. Take this ass out. <laughs> nah, real shit, though. I ain't playing, though. Real shit, though. But anyway, so look. These dark brothers are draconians, reptilians, insectilians. Are very, well, they own, the, they own the, like, the planet Viraria. That's kind of like a dwarf star. It's a whole different story. That's some shit that's over there by Saturn. Um, what else you got? Basically, that's pretty much it. Like, you got Pleiadians and all that shit, too. But that shit, like, a whole different story. Because Pleiadians is mixed. Like, they're like a human type of elf type of race or some shit like that. Then you got motherfucking, um, what's this other fucking star or planet? It's actually known. It's called something. I forgot what it's called. Like, I forgot what the fuck this shit called. I'm gonna have to look it up. But it's a real thing, and it got entities on there and shit. It's like, like Mars and shit. The Martians, that shit real. But a lot of this shit is dark forces, and a lot of this shit comes from these entities, like these ideologies and these the shit that these people follow and this shit. All this shit, it comes from. A certain type of um, 
it comes from a certain type of, like, I don't know, like, ideology, motherfucking, like, um, these principles and shit that they learn, like, from these demons, right? So, for example, like, one of the biggest demons that, like, known to man is Aleister Crowley, and he's from Britain, and he used to conjure up demonic entities and shit to get information from them and power by doing nasty, disgusting, demonic shit, everything that was blasphemous to God, this guy Alistair would do, and he used it to conjure up demonic energy. You see what I'm saying? And that demonic energy got so strong to the point where that energy has to go somewhere so it manifests into him meeting that fucking alien that he met. And I forget the fucking alien name. It's called Roger or some shit like that. I forgot. But he met an alien. And um, the alien was just giving him information and shit. That's how the Nazis and shit got their information. You see what I'm saying? By following what Alistair Crowley used to get like old practices and whatnot. You see? And um, yeah, that's how they was able to get that technology and shit. Like they already had the smarts and shit, but they just didn't have that extra, like, power, so to speak, so they use that from the old this knowledge as a, like a boost to help them heal uh, Hitler's third right. You see what I'm saying? This is all in history, so you can look that shit up if they had to. But um, that's the same thing with these, these entities. This is why a lot of these people get these ideas and shit from. It's from these entities. You see what I'm saying? And that's what a lot of these ideologies of these dark brothers and dark lords and shit come from. It's just shit real, like, because they can program the energy people to what you think. Like, it's, it's another form of, like, a crucial sound weaponry, but I'm going to just say this is just part one, though. Gang, fuck Satan, fuck all this man. Now we rocking that. Both of us, man. Yeah, fuck Satan, bitch.